Get strapped in. It's just about time to get the party started. And we are underway from AT&T Stadium. Taken at the goal line. And he'll get it up just past the 20 as his guys will go to work at the 21-yard line. They'll start on the ground. It's Rashad Penny. And just no chance of turning the corner. He can only get back to the line of scrimmage. Second and ten coming up. Looking here for Smith downfield. And that nearly an interception here on this opening drive, but he gets a reprieve. It's third down. You get a sense of what this game plan might be. They think they can take a few home run shots against this defense. They tried it there on the opening drive, but that ball's incomplete. Crowd getting in it a bit already. Here's an early third and ten. They'll bring a receiver in motion right. Throwing his hurts. Open man, that's Devontae Smith. And he's going to have an Eagles first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Penny, a first down carry. And he'll get this up past the 45 to the 47. Eight yards on the pickup, and now they'll have some options on second and short. Now they'll run it again with Penny. And he'll be brought down at the 48-yard line. So on the other side of the field now, it's first and 10 as they've got things rolling on this drive. Burt sets up to throw it. He'll get this out wide to Penny. And he'll get it inside the 40 to the 39. They still need about the length of the football here, maybe a little less as they come up on second and inches. And here he'll be brought down a little shy of the 35 at the 36. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Hurts. This is Smith to the ground. A good pick up there, 21 yards. Line of scrimmage, the 15. It's first and 10. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Rashad Penny, a 15-yard touchdown run. And the Eagles get the upper hand as they're on the board first here this afternoon. And that caps off what was really a balanced opening drive for them, Charles. They work in the rushing game and the aerial attack, and they end it with a touchdown. Strong in so many ways, wasn't it, partner? Their ability to throw it and run it and accomplish their goal, they've got to like the way that they started this ball game. Elliott good on the extra point, and that makes the score 7-0. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape up past the 30. So Prescott to the Cowboys now with a first and 10 at the 31 yard line. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. And that is incomplete. Oh, the coverage a little too good there. And it's second down. That's a tough spot for a running back coming out of the backfield because you know he's got to look for the football. Knowing full well, he's got a man coming his way full steam, and he broke that one up. Second down, Prescott. 
This pass complete to Pollard on the out route. 11 yards and a Cowboy first down. We'll see what kind of mindset they have here offensively after giving up the touchdown on the opening drive. And based on our time with them, you know, prior to this game, I feel like they've got a good mindset going in. In fact, the discussion that we had with the coaching staff was, you know, we may give up some points in this game, so our offense has to be ready each and every time to either equal or try and get us ahead and try and keep us ahead. This is their chance to respond to that first touchdown given up. Prescott looks to throw on first. And just not enough on the throw there. Down around his feet and incomplete. They'll put a check mark in the box where the defense coordinator was saying, how well can we stay with these receivers if we're in man coverage? Because he just did it on that one. Force the incompletion. That allowed him to get bolder with his pass rush, won't it? Absolutely. Freeze up your guys elsewhere. Now Prescott. Ball delivered complete on the crossing route, Gallup. They get six. That'll leave them with third and four. The goal for any offense versus his own defense, find the holes where guys are available and put the ball on the receiver before any defender can step up and fill it. They did it well there. Perfectly executed crossing route. A short one there taken in by Ferguson. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. A big play that time on the catch and run. And it's going to yield a new set of downs. They'll throw again. Prescott. And that went too far in front. He couldn't reel it in. It's incomplete. An incomplete pass leads to second and 10 from the 25. Prescott. He'll get only three there, so it leaves him with a third and seven ahead. That's a game three. It's third and seven. On third down, it's Prescott. On the left side, Gallup's got it. And he has another first down as he'll get the ball down to the Eagles' 12-yard line. Start of the second quarter, and it's the Cowboys in possession as they've got it with a first and 10. Now a shotgun handoff to Pollard. And he'll be dropped at about the 11 after only a yard. Well, they certainly had success throwing the ball on this drive, and not as much running it as we just saw once again on that last play, stopped after a very short game. But I wouldn't abandon the run totally, because otherwise, pass rushers just tee off on your quarterback, makes it very, very difficult for him in that situation. Second down, Pollard again. And he'll be brought down this time at the five-yard line. Give him six yards on the carry. It's going to be third and three now. Coming up here looking for three yards to pick up the first. They'll try and run for it with Vaughn. And he won't have the touchdown, but he will have the first down as he's tackled at the two. Only three there on the pickup, but that's enough to move the chains. So another third down conversion, and now they've got a first and goal. Pollard trying to get to the goal line, but he's going to be stopped just short at the one. Only a yard on the pickup there. Second and goal. Brings up second and goal. Pollard again. Tony Pollard taking it in from a yard out. And the Cowboys are an extra point away now from tying this ball game. Extra point right down the middle. And we are tied at seven.
Each team's had it. Each team has scored. 7-7 seven, seven here as the kick's away. From a yard or two deep, here comes a return. And no chance to get away as they'll get him down at about the 17-yard line. The Eagles offense set to begin their next drive. So both of these teams, Charles, coming off touchdowns now, but this offense, they just had to stand on the sideline, watch their opponent author a really impressive drive to reach the end zone. Yeah, and I think you're not telling yourself the truth if you don't think there's some one upsmanship going on right now because they just had their touchdown answered by a drive of double-digit plays that also found the end zone. Now they want to do something even more impressive to answer that one. So a nightmare start to the drive as they're already staring at second and long. Here's Hurts to throw. Over the middle, and it's incomplete. They certainly thought he had a window to push that ball downfield, but as soon as he released the throw, the corner was there to slam that window shut. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And he's going to go down right near the goal line. The officials look at each other. They're going to mark him at the one-yard line. The Eagles send out their punter now. And no room for air here as his first punt comes from deep in his own end zone. And from their own end zone, it's a fake. And this is incomplete. A huge gamble, and it does not pay off. They fake the punt. It doesn't work out. And how about this for a setup? The ball will go over on downs at the one-yard line. The best starting field position you could possibly have. First and goal from the one. Now here's Pollard. And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Tony Pollard with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Cowboys have taken the lead. Point after, right down the middle. And that makes the score 14-7. is the kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. And no return on this one as the fair catch is signaled for and taken. Already at the line, this Philly offense set to go. That 7 nothing lead of theirs short-lived as they've now given up two straight touchdowns to fall behind by seven. Yeah, but no cause for discouragement here. Yeah, they've fallen behind, but haven't they proven that they can go down and score? So what was the formula that got them down there the first time? Get back to something close to that, and maybe they can get this game tied up. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. Fair to say, it hasn't been his best game throwing the football, but also not getting a lot of help out there either. Yeah, you kind of you nailed it pretty well, you know. <laughs> He's got to throw it better. Got to get more help. Obviously one that should have been caught. They got to find a way to bring those, those two elements together so they can make some progress in this one. Into a double team, and it's intercepted. And they will take over at the 29-yard line. And, Brandon, this is a real nice job defensively, yeah, getting inside the quarterback's head and figuring out, okay, where is he going with the football? Because you can make an educated guess defensively, not all the time, but sometimes. And when you're right, you've got a decent chance of coming away with the football. And he'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. 25 yards that time. First play of the drive, excellent run. Just sets up wash, rinse, repeat. Another first down. On 
First down, a running play ends up going backwards as he won't get close to the line of scrimmage. In fact, he's going to lose four yards. The running lanes have definitely not been there for him here in the first half, and I don't think it's all been his fault. His offensive line hasn't given him much space. A loss results there. The Eagles going to take the first of their timeouts as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Prescott now from the 50. It's hauled in by Brandon Cooks. They'll get it inside the 20. He's to the 15. Touchdown, Cowboys! Brandon Cooks, 50 yards. And the Cowboys go up by two touchdowns. So, Charles, that's three touchdowns on three drives, and it's just been an offensive barrage so far. Great word, partner, using barrage right there. I'm going to add another word if you don't mind. How about perfection? No surprise that they're leading right now. Absolute dominance throughout this ball game, and no signs of slowing down. Point after, up and good. And it's now 21-7. The kick team out there for the Cowboys as they run up to send this one away. From a couple yards deep, he'll bring it out of the end zone. And they'll be backed up to start this drive as he's taken down right around the 15. offense set to begin their next drive. And Charles, we'll see what they can do here. Not a ton of time left, but enough certainly to get oh, everything falling apart now. Another one intercepted. And he takes this one back into the end zone. And the Cowboy defense has a touchdown. That bumps us up to a three-possession game here and only in the second quarter, Charles. They're trying to put this game out of reach before we even hit the locker rooms for intermission. What's even tougher is making up three possessions against a defense that can make impact plays like this. They don't have this game wrapped up quite yet, but two picks already, one to the house. I think it's fair to say they're headed in the right direction. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. Hurts now hoping to make up for that pick six. Nowhere to go here. He lost the football. But I believe it was covered by an eagle. It was. And Philadelphia is going to hold on to the football. After the sack, oh, they're staring at a challenge basically from the other side of town. It's second at a country mile. Penny up the middle. And he'll find some room to get this up to about the 14. The Cowboys are going to use their second timeout now as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. On third down, Penny. And they'll bring him down at the 27-yard line. The Cowboys single for their third and final timeout as the clock stops here with 46 seconds remaining in the first half. And Hurts not coming to the sideline. They're going to go for it. They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. And he's brought down. Can't do it. 